in a world. Michael, it's a book. No. <laughs> in a book. First of all, who makes metaphors by using weasels? I read. Hot take, folks. I don't want to read. <laughs> Where weasels are hard to find. Another story by Annie Dillard. Another story about animals, where they come to life. But this one's about a weasel. Not a real weasel, though. It's human nature. It's human nature. <laughs> Annie Dillard comes to life. Oh my god, weasels. I love weasels. In a world where cute things are not what they seem. In a world! Grace got a five o'clock shadow in this picture. Her old Snickers are still tempting. In a world... Where spiders aren't just arachnids. <laughs> How old is Snickers? In a world! <laughs> this guy eats an old Snickers. One must try it all to find out. <laughs> How old is, is this exactly? I got it in eighth grade. Once off the shelf. <laughs> in a world where this is still okay. Oh! <laughs> Where a squirrel doesn't even want those nuts. In a world where this puppy is a demon. Hello, I'm your weasel leader. Annie Diller creates the idea that living off extraneous things will complicate our lives. However, living off the bare essentials is the best way of life because it's so easy. Wants hold us back and needs push you forward. Push you forward. Without these wants, we won't complicate our lives. That's for the purpose. Oh. <clears throat> you done? Proceed. In, the, in this world. What? <laughs> <laughs> in this magnificent. <laughs> core. In this magnificent world. Almost says magnificent is fine, coach. New album out on Spotify and iTunes and Apple Music and SoundCloud and Spotify. Did I say Spotify already? Not In a world! Analysis. Once hold us back, like stated before. It's value because the weasel lives an easy life. Because its main goal is to survive. Survive. Without these wants, we wouldn't complicate our lives. We would not worry about the things that don't matter. Distractions would distract us. And if we didn't distract ourselves with desires, we would be able to embrace our true nature. The best life ever. Annie Diller creates this idea to convince her audience to live a simpler life. She compels them to live off the necessities instead of living off of materialistic things. By focusing their true nature and way of life, nothing will get in the way. Coming this fall, Annie Dillard is back with Weasels and I, part two. <laughs> Starring Arnold Schwarzenegger as Weasel Schwarzenegger. <laughs> Meryl Streep as Annie Dillard. Why, you may ask? If they do not listen, they would complicate their lives. They limit themselves because they are the ones that cannot focus on the things that will truly affect their lives. They are too distracted. No. Society makes them believe that the materialistic things are a necessity. Annie Dillard is here to say, nah, uh, uh. Society wants you to think that your wants are more important than your needs. And what really matters here, folks, are the weasels. Weasels are back this summer. Starring. You just said it was in fall. Weasel 3 doesn't get any more weaselier. Comes out the same day as Weasel 4, starring Arnold Schwarzenegger as Weasel Schwarzenegger, fighting off against the gopher from Shad Caddyshack. Oops, ran over a weasel. What a lovely family heirloom. She creates this understanding by the use of weasels. The symbolism of this, the sim, the cinnamon of the. Symbolism. Sriracha of weasels. The symbol she uses Annie Dillard. Annie Dillard uses this symbolism of weasels 
to say that materialistic things don't matter. Instead of Annie Diller texting on her iPhone and seeing what her boyfriend's up to, she should be more focused on the weasels who live a more primitive life. AKA, only goal is to survive. No Instagram updates will fool this weasel. No, he's only worried about one thing. What's for dinner? Who said weasels? They're always bad. Hold on one second. Hello? Weasels! <laughs> Annie Dillard is back. Weasel 85. Back again this summer. The weasel's on the loose. I'm going weasel hunting. <laughs> this fall! <laughs> yes? Hello? Weasel Army.